Oh god. <laughs> Welcome back to Instant Questions Live. Couples Questions Live. I'm sorry. I messed it I'm up. I'm sorry too. <laughs> yeah. Um, Rachel, what things do you think I look forward to each day in my life? <laughs> um, video games? Yes. That's it. <laughs> no, there's more. Getting off of work? That's, that's true. But, I mean, who doesn't, really? Yeah. Um, Time uh, together. Yeah. I um, mean, at a strip club. At no, my apartment. No. Oh, that's what it said. No. Uh, DL. <laughs> okay, um, you look forward to the just... I mean, I'm going to default back to the TV room since that didn't work on the previous episode question. We're playing Typing of the Dead, but we're also playing a getting-to-know-each-other couple game. Sometimes I would like to get out of the TV room and do things in the real world with my husband, uh, the caveman. <laughs> yeah. But um, it's hard to get him away from the video games. If anyone has any suggestions, <laughs> please leave them in the comments, please. How about um, please? you work on the show with me, and then we spend more time together. I, I like to get out of the house. No, that's silly. Someday. Leaving the house is pointless. Convince the man to go camping, internet. Oh, I died. Ugh. No, I expect This is you what to happens die. when you go camping. It's not. It is. You die in the forest. No. You do. Sometimes. Yeah. But I never have. Well. Oh, that happened to me once, though. Man, this is some <gasps> pugging shit. Okay. Um, He's going to have a baby. Next questions. Ooh, that's not a... Oh. What? Tap. 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 These guys are fast. Three wishes. What uh -huh. are they? And you're answering for me, remember. Oh, answering for you. You set up um, the rules to this game. Right, In the previous right, right, episode. Right, right. Uh, you would wish to be um, rich and internet famous. I, I don't think I would. That's all you talk about. Yeah, but you don't. First of all, no, it isn't. That's it's ridiculous. It's a lot of what you talk about. And asinine. <laughs> it's okay. not even true. That's kind of how I feel when you say that I spend all my happy times in the TV room. Okay, so this is turning into a fight. <laughs> it's on not a air. fight. It's called counseling. Um, no, I don't talk about trying to be in an all the time. So don't. Okay, maybe make I'm shit phrasing. Up. I'm. I think I'm phrasing it wrong. Uh, what are those? Oh, vultures. Yeah, sure. Go on, phrase it right. Um, because now you've offended me. You you do want to be rich. You talk about yeah. that a lot. And I would I'd totally like be willing to wish for you know being wealthy. I I wouldn't wish to be internet famous. Hmm. Um, a celebrity? No. I feel like that's something you've talked about. Wishing? No. Hmm. Okay. Well, tell me then, because obviously I have the wrong idea. What is it that you wish for? I mean, yeah, I want to be wealthy in the way that what I'm doing is always a pursuit I want to be going after. Sure. And that's what I'm envious of for YouTubers and such because of like the high-end YouTubers like Game Grumps or whoever else. Um, I'm envious of their ability to be creative and successful, mm -hmm. um, and effectively their own bosses, I although there's reasons that know that's that not true. know that creative pursuits are important to you. Highly. Yes. And, but I feel like, I don't know, I'm, I'm a little offended that you would think it's all about, like, getting rich and famous for me. I guess I meant as a means to be able to do those other things. No. It's... Well, that's what it's, I meant. It's about the end game. So, I mean... Some okay. way wishes would, you know, that would build towards that would be the goal. Mm -hmm. Um. All right, we're, we kind of lost the point of this game, I think. Okay. Well, what's the next question? Yeah. <laughs> Try to find a happier question. I mean, they're in order. They're just oh, okay. they're questions in a list. Um. I'll try to look down the list, talk for a bit. Um. Because all the next like questions are like, what would you change else Those in your life? What are, are your really major fast. regrets? Maybe we should skip to the other list. Let's, uh, About our boyfriends and girlfriends. Yeah. All right. Um, 
of which I don't have any, but I'm taking applications. Jesus. Leave leave notes in the comments. Those questions were a couple's tag on YouTube questions. Oh. And, um... The ones that we were already answering? No, no. Oh, okay. The, the ones you were talking about, the other list. Because I don't like those other questions. <sighs> Jesus Christ. No, I mean the ones that we were just answering. Yes, okay. Tab, um, tab. But Shit. I think it's telling and pretty funny that the couples tag doesn't refer to married couples. It refers specifically to boyfriends and girlfriends. It's not like your significant other. It's like, what would your boyfriend or girlfriend think about this? A five-minute lap dance. Yes. What would they think about a five-minute <laughs> lap dance? Um, which I think just tells that, like, I'm way too old for YouTube. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, no, I don't... I don't know. But, okay. Here we go. A lot of people... We're gonna we're gonna substitute significant other for VFGF as sure. a list here. If your significant other could be married to a movie star, <laughs> who would it be? All right. Um, am I answering for you? You set the rules. But yes. No, I know, I know. I'm I'm trying to think. This this one is actually intended to be answered for the other person. Okay. So yes. Oh my god. You are answering for your significant other, which is me. Um. You've, you've said this before, and I'm trying to remember who it was. I haven't said who I'd m marry. No, but you you mentioned Nick rarely talks about um, finding celebrities attractive or things like that. Uh, you talk he doesn't about have it his list. all the damn time. Yeah, well, I mean, I feel like it's more. I don't have a list. No, I, that's what I just said. Oh, I thought you said he does have his list. No. I was going to say I don't have one. Okay, okay, go um, ahead. But you told me somebody not long ago. Did I start a goddamn timer? No, I don't think you did. Oh, Why didn't you tell me to do that? Was it, um... Ugh, I have no idea how long we've been on this. This is Selma Hayek. Terrible episode. Okay, I forget. Who okay. was it? It was somebody like Selma Hayek? Who I told you is not who my answer would be for marriage. Oh, okay. Um, I have told you in the past that I found... And this also has faded a lot with time. Yeah. Like, this isn't even true. This was like, we're talking literally ten years ago you asked me this question. <laughs> okay. And it's who I said ten years ago was Shakira. But Oh, I don't, weird. I don't yeah, even... no, we've talked about it more recently than uh, that. Oh, oh, our cat Barnabas sneezes a lot. Yeah, he has a giant snot hanging off of his oh, face Nick's right now. Oh, Nick's gonna have to get it. Nope, he's licking it up. Oh. <laughs> that's just that's, what we call pillow talk. It's disgusting. It's just what we call cathartic violence. Okay. Um, okay, who who would mine be? Uh, oh, wait, no, who would you marry? I don't... I, I probably wouldn't remarry. <laughs> you bastard. Ow. Because um, you could never love someone as much as you love me. That's right. It's absolutely true. You have, like, 50 people, but I'm going to say top list, no fielding. <laughs> oh, my God. That's probably true. Yeah. Top of the list. Of, oh, of man. so many options, though. I mean... Okay, who are the next couple down the list? I mean, Bruce Campbell's in there somewhere. I'm not yes. saying he's next, but he's up there. Um, probably um, the actress who played Xena. No, actually. <laughs> Although, I, you know... Or the actress who played Xena's friend. No, not at all. <laughs> huh. Um, no, you, you do not understand my taste in the ladies, apparently. Uh, oh, really? No, apparently. Ugh. Okay, then who? Um... I don't even... Oh, hang on. This is gonna be the most uncomfortable episode of Instant Replay Live. Shit. There's a uh, lot of things. Yeah, I mean, um, you, you did it, though, and went silent the whole time. <laughs> yeah, okay, no, I, I... I don't know. Um... My other answer would have been, um... Probably Alan Rickman. But oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. I know Alan Rickman's on your list. I, we were talking about women, though. I know, that's a harder question. Because I know there are women on your list. Yeah, but I'm having trouble thinking. Zoe Deschanel. Aw, oh, she's cute. Um, maybe. She's on there somewhere. Yeah, alright. Um, okay, next question, next question. I'll think about it, I'll think about okay. it. If your significant other could be a celebrity, this is interesting following the other bullshit, mm -hmm. um, who would it be? Now, this is an active celebrity, an existing celebrity. Like? If I could be a celebrity who is real, 
Do you mean I would turn you into somebody different? No, you don't. If I could choose one, you're trying to pick what oh, I would oh, pick. Oh, 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 right, right. If, so what celebrity would you like to be? Yes. Um, I would say one of the Game Grubs. Uh, no, I'd dream bigger than that. Really? Yeah, I mean, they're super cool. Like, I would love to have that level, but I wouldn't want to be one of them. Um, so no, I, I would think, like, I'm becoming a human being who exists. Mm -hmm. I would go with a bigger star, probably, um, who... Patrick Swayze. No, no. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> yeah, that would be terrible. See, because that was my thought was like... Patrick Swayze? No, 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 no. My thought, though, was Slime like, cows. the initial answer is Bruce Campbell, except that Bruce Campbell is um, older. And Shut I don't want to be that old. You, you know, I don't want to lose that that much Shut of my life. So I'd Robert probably... Downey Jr. But he's 50. But he's an attractive I, man. I mean, I'm not saying 50 is that old. I'm just saying I wouldn't want he's to suddenly... He's in his prime. I wouldn't want to go from 30 to 50 overnight. That's yeah, 20 right, years right, lost. Right. So I would probably pick someone younger than me just so I could live longer. The question is, like, when you become this person, do you get all that person's intelligence or and personality? And then effectively Justin you just killed yourself. Bieber. No. Effectively you've just killed yourself, if so. Yeah. But... I don't know younger celebrities. What, what are the boundaries of this question, YouTube tag? I want to know. Um... All right, Who did would I say I yours? No, um, I, I I don't know my answer. I'm curious. It's uh, something I'd have to think. These questions are harder than that, I thought they'd be. That is that is a tough one for you, too. Probably Zoe Deschanel. <laughs> no, no, I don't think so. so. Yeah, I, I wouldn't think so for real. I was just referencing the previous question. Oh, I know who I'd be. Who? Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Okay. I could be Joseph Gordon-Levitt, too. If we were if... both Joseph Gordon-Levitt, man. <laughs> that would be weird. <laughs> um... <laughs> He's probably older than you. Yeah, but probably not super older. Yeah. He's probably close. All right. You've gone to 7-Eleven to get milk, and you decide to buy your significant other a treat. Mm -hmm. What did you buy? I probably... Oh, remember how these things work. I'm saying what I got for you. That's not what you're supposed to do. I'm having trouble. <laughs> you were the one <laughs> who set the rules previously. <laughs> Uh, you need to answer what I would buy you if I was buying you a okay. treat. Okay, what you would buy me. I mean, I guess this question could go the other way. Because it is a little more direct than the yeah. others. It's written differently. Alright, fine. Tell me what you'd buy me. Go ahead. Um, I would probably get you uh, a tea and one of those, um, I don't know what they're called. The little, like, cheese Danish style pastry things. The, um, yeah, the cheese pastry is that yeah, called 7-Eleven. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And I would also buy you a cheese pastry. And depending on the time of day, it would probably be a coffee or a Gatorade. Good but, answer. But we've I been buying be each other cheese pastries since we met each other. Yep. The first time we hung out, we walked by 7-Eleven afterwards. Not the first time we hung out. Second time we hung out. We walked by 7-Eleven afterwards and we bought cheese pastries. Did we? Yep. And then, real cheese danishes. <laughs> they became a major part of our early but relationship as well. You can only buy those from Baker's Cross. Well, anywhere you can buy them, but those particular ones. But the other ones aren't real. Okay, well. Okay. Next time on Instant Replay Live, less cheese pastry. And some jailhouse judgment. <laughs> Really kick it. Kick Yo, it. plans, free stroke, Sonic Golf. Sonic Golf.